ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to today's video. Today is a follow-up video from our last one, where we went up the canyon and took all these photos. Now, we are going to be editing them. We're not going to edit all of them, due to the fact there's like almost 500, or I guess there's 641 photos, but we will be editing some of them. So, let's get started, shall we? First one on the list is this one right here. First off, drain crop. And then I like how Lightroom added this feature, but you can do auto rotate. Could not strain this photo, perfect. I still think it's a little off, so I'll just tweak it like that. There we go, boom. Perfect, I think that's a little bit better. Now then, I do have presets all over here. We can go through. I normally like to start out the first photo I always take, or the first photo I edit. I always like to start out going through all the presets. This way I can see different styles, just different ways I can edit it, what I like, what I don't like, etc. I know for a fact I'm not doing any black and white ones. I don't think black and white will fit this at all due to the fact that it is fall. I do want to take advantage of those colors. So we'll skip the black and whites. We'll skip all these right here. We have all these options. Eh, that's a lot to look through. We'll skip those for now. Let's go to the presets I've made. A few moments later. Yeah, it looks like we're going to need to just make our own. Make a new one. So, first off, what we want to do. We want to warm things up. Just a little bit. Copy it. Yes, check all that. Copy. And now let's move over to our second photo with the same subject. Okay, second photo with the same subject. We're just gonna paste it. And look at that. Incredible. We will bring this down just a little. About right there. That way his skin's not so yellow. Because if we go any lower, then it goes blue and everything we worked for is gone. So, 5700, bring it back. This one, I want to bring the greens. I want to make them more of like a yellow. We can hide them if we want, or we can bring them out a lot. I don't want to do that. I just want to hide them just a little bit, darken it, kind of like that. There we go. And then we'll go to the last one, which is over here. I'm just, this was at the end when I was taking off my hoodie. Paste it on, come in, crop it, zoom in a little bit. Just like so. I like having a, a heavy, it's called a weighted bottom. We do it a lot in picture framing where we like have a little extra at the bottom at the top. Cause if we look down here, the gap between the bottom of the photo and my feet is more than that. Not much, but it is a little bit, which is why we call it weighting the bottom. Anyway, that's that. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I'm going to finish editing all these now. If you want to see them, I'll be posting them on my Instagram, which is down below. It's Zach Kig if you guys want to check them out. You don't have to, but if you want to see them, they're there. We did a lot of me and my other subject, my brother. But yeah, be sure to go watch our last video of us on this fun adventure. It was a really good time. We will be going again. So prepare. I might film another video with that. I haven't decided yet. But there will be at least a couple more fall videos coming. Because I just love photography in the fall. There's so many colors and it's so great to work with. So yeah, with that, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. And we will see you guys in the next video. Thanks so much. Bye for now.